There was a lot of talk, which was interesting, that like, no, nah, he can't come back, he's too far gone. And that was probably the best thing I could have heard. I mean, it really motivated me to do well. And I went from dead last at, at the first competition to first place, and, and it, it was something that felt amazing for me because I had put in all that work into actually learning these new tricks and then to be able to perform them under pressure at that moment and against the best guys in the world and to win, I mean, that was everything. When people say that I really can't do things, that's when I kick into a different gear and I try to show them that they're wrong. I definitely don't think winning is everything, but hard work can pay off. I seem to do a little bit better when the pressure's on. I like the feel of the crowd, and I like the element of the excitement, and it seems to bring the best out in me. I would say for me the idea is to wrap my head so much around the trick that I don't think about it anymore. I've analyzed it so much that I know what the snow is going to look like, I know where my body's going to be at position wise and I just go. I visualize everything before I drop it. I feel like for this X Games you can expect me to rise to the occasion. I'm going there with winning in mind, so I'm, I'm going to try to put my best efforts toward that goal. People want to go like, what did it take to win the X Games? Yeah, there's a lot of nerves, but there's been so much back-end practice that this is that moment. It's like, you wrote the song, now you just play it.